unboxing the Microsoft Surface Pro <coughs> i3 <coughs> bought at Best Buy <coughs> so <coughs> welcome back folks to another episode of um, yet another uh, I don't know, what should I call this, this, uh, YouTube channel? <clears throat> all things tech, tech, all things, all things techie? No. I don't know. I have... <clears throat> a web um a website that I would like to start called uh gyrosoft.co I used to have gyrosoft.com and <clears throat> now I <clears throat> I reserved gyrosoft.co because dot com wasn't available anymore. So, I don't know what I'm going to call this, uh, I either start a new YouTube channel or, or what? Mm -mm, no. Ooh, look at it. <clears throat> Unboxing. Well, I have to do two unboxings. The shipping box and the actual box of the product. Okay. Let's see. It says Microsoft Surface Pro. So I got the right product. My sister ordered it for herself. So I'm going to take the opportunity to unbox it for her and set her up with her Microsoft account. So it says it's a Microsoft Surface Pro 7 with Windows 10 Home. It comes with the power supply, hmm? support for Wi-Fi 802.11ax. Bluetooth. You must accept enclosed license agreement and warranty and agree agreement. There's a support.microsoft.com uh, website that you have to go to before you can use this device. <clears throat> so <clears throat> that means I'll need. Um, Wi-Fi, right? Yep. Uh, this house I'm in, my, my mother and sister's house, has a uh, pretty good Wi-Fi. For 2020, <clears throat> it's uh, with Spectrum, and it's uh, way up there. 400 download, maybe 100 upload. And they've connected directly. <clears throat> yeah, if it was wired connection. So, <clears throat> wirelessly, it'll be a lot less. It can be like around, depending where I'm at. I'm saying about 100 download and 10 or, 10 or so upload. Okay. So, here we have... Microsoft Surface Pro. Wow, it's pretty big. It's bigger than my my iPad. Well, I don't have I don't have a an iPad Pro, but I have a regular iPad. I think it's a iPad 6th generation or is it? 
I'm looking around for it. No, I don't have it around here. <clears throat> but you guys know what it looks like. Let's see, so. Hmm. Hmm. So, what did I, what should I do first? Take it out? Wow. I took it out. Hmm. What's this? Let's see. Hmm. Look at this documentation. Microsoft Surface Pro. And what is this? A sticker? Let's see what's what's in here. So you have the volume rocker <clears throat> up here on the top. There it is. The volume rocker. Do do do. And that's the power button. Then over here, you have a camera, a uh, face sensor, a microphone, a microphone, I guess for speaker, for stereo, a USB, USB. Oh. Come on, focus. Focus. There we go. I'm using my my Samsung S10. Let's see. Uh, what is that? That's the power. Wow. Can the USB be used for power? Maybe. There's regular USB. What's on the other side? On the uh, this is uh, the bottom of it. You can't see it with this. With the uh, well, this side doesn't have anything. There's the left side. What's that? I'm not sure. Oh. Just to take the bottom off, I guess. Oh, that's like the kickstand. And that's the... It's for a... Uh, uh, 3.5 uh, millimeter jack for audio. Let's see. What is this? Mm. That's a brick, a power brick, a, um, what is it, a power adapter, AC to DC, out, DC out, let's see, what are the specs on this, mm, let's see if I can, let's see if I can zoom in on this. Using telephoto, is it, can it handle it? Oh, it's upside down. 65 watt, I saw. Let's see, okay, on the top it says Windows. And it's uh, got all these symbols. And then, Oh, right here it says Microsoft Model 1706, made in China. Okay, input 100 to 240 volt at around 1.6 amp. 50 to 60 hertz. Output, it'll produce 15 volt DC. 
of 4 amp out. It will also produce 5 volt 1 amp. So I can use this to charge a phone with USB-C. If this is USB-C out. Oh no. Now look what it's like. Maybe it's magnetic, but it's also got pins on on it. Can't see. Let's see. Pins on it. On both sides. Okay. Oh look. On one side it's got USB A. And this so you could either charge it with this or a USB C USB A to USB C cord, right? Let's see. So this is uh this is what goes on over here, right? Okay. So what should I do? Should I charge it a while? I think I will. Just to make sure it's charged completely. I don't know if it'll help. Some, some devices ask you to charge it completely before using. So, I mean, as well do that. Maybe it's not required for this one. Ah. Uh. Uh. And I p pushed it in. Uh. Okay, that's the other side of it. You don't need to have that ground pin. And I'm going to plug it in here. Oh, here. Oh. And then I'm going to plug it in here. Let's see. Let's see. Where do I put it in? Well, let me take off this uh, protective cover that's temporary so we can remove it. And uh, throw it away. What are those symbols? Hmm. Yes, it says. What are these symbols? Pet. Is that what this is? Pet, pet, pet. It's got a QR code. Hmm. Damn, I can't focus. There. I'm going to pause.